Daily Underground Radio Station. This is Radio R. This is Overhead. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is Tabu Nawash of the Black Eyed Peas. Hey, hey, I'm Tinashe. This is Papa Denis Le Grand Mkulu Kulu, Mwana wa Zambia. Let's go. Yes, sir. What's up, 254? And the rest of the world, come on, 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 Your amazing channel. This is Radio RFM. Drop off with full doses. Something trending, something related to the media industry, to the entertainment industry. Now, let me tell you, I have the amazing Mr. Full Pistons himself, Borao Kipenda, and the KRG The Dawn. What's up, bro? I'm going to go best. This is Mr. Fresh. kuliko pesa nilisema elimu ni muhimu okay okay mm-hmm. lakini pesa mingi ni muhimu zaidi lakini elimu ni kidogo yani si lazima kuwa elimu nyingi ukikuwa na kidogo tuna pesa nyingi ndio best kwa sababu utanipa wale wamesomba wa kufanya shughuli Yes. Don't you know one, one of the youngest millionaires was since a billionaire. Mm. Mm. How do you define success? You as a person, you as care to the don. Success is freedom to me. Na mwenye sawa na taka. Naenda pale na taka. Ukifika pale ukisikia kukula mananasi, uanze kuuliza ni pesa ngapi? Unakula ile kitu unataka. Ukisikia sasa hivi nataka kunywa maji ya mfereji na kunywa hiyo maji. Ukisikia unataka kwenda pahali fulani hiyo ndio ndio success. Na hizo ni different success. You get this guy. I don't bother with for anything. Okay. So and um, another thing ni kwa um, it opens up a lot of um, how do I say opportunities not opportunities there is still under success yeah it's very diverse success is very I mean, you cannot just explain that the success in its life and mm-hmm. it's, it's very wide all right because mm-hmm. you are one of the artists in your main who are relevant for quite a longer time you still mm-hmm. remain employed exactly to remain relevant to your fans remain relevant to the industry mm, i think i don't shy off from anyone wewe ukileta group mimi na kuvuruga hapo na shanga ulianza nini Another thing I'm always real to the core. You never miss it. Kwa ni ko vegan bila unaniona hivi ndio ipo. Utanipata tena ni saa nyingine nimebadilika nimekuwa kitu kingine ama iko mtu anakuja kuniambia kitu kingine mimi nikubali kama nimekataa nimekataa nikikubali nimekubali na nikupenda nimependa. Kwa hiyo that's how me na relate na watu wangu. So I'm real to the core. You know. Unajua watu wanatafuta kitu real. So once you shall do any real my fans wanakuwa na wewe day in day out. KRG the don ni ni mwanamuziki ni mwanabiashara ama nini exactly to the core. KRG the don ni brand. Okay ni brand ya mwana muziki. Kwa hiyo hii mwili yangu imebeba vitu mingi kama iko KRG the Don. Iko boha. Umenielewa? Iko Kimani. Okay. Okay. Iko baba na vile. Iko mambo mingi kwa hii mwili mbovu. Iko mwana biashara, iko mkulima, iko mwana muziki, mm-hmm. iko comedian. Mm-hmm iko rafiki how do you mind iko adui una balance hizo zote kivi sasa si kila kila nitasema nini ni kama remote una remote ama hiyo computer sio niko na button mingi kila button iko na kazi yake sasa wewe inategemea mtu afanye nini umenielewa so mimi na balance kulingana na ile kitu nataka achieve at that particular moment so which one do you prioritize qualifier kwa muziki biashara ama nini my life maisha yako maisha yangu kwanza kwa sababu zile hii maisha yangu hizo vitu zingine zote zina date Umeleta kwa hivyo bila bila hii mwili kwanza boha yuko meisha medeti umeleta bila hii mwili kazi tena hayuko bila hii mwili biashara hakuna so in so life kwanza ni feel gani ume 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 specify sana kazi muziki au biashara biashara kwanza kwa sababu unajua muziki ni entertainment so muziki umefanya kile biashara si ndio hiyo sasa ndio nakuja hapo sasa a biashara kwa sababu kwa sababu muziki ni part of the business so in business ndio everything ndio umbrella ile inabeba vitu yote 
sasa ndio nakuja muziki maduka baba mama nyumba madem baba yote naingia hapo okay so far so far so good unaweza describe your journey music bit Mm. Inakuwa imekuwa fiti unajua um, kuanza kitu ni waga ngumu lakini sasa vile nilishapeleka peleka mbele um, kuanzia mwanzo ilikuwa ngumu kidogo sasa tukashukuma it was up there it was the task going up because i remember the so, time the time quick fit ni time genge to ni jambisi sasa nilikuwa hapo hapo nimeshuka nilikuwa nimeingia sasa nasikia mwingia deep dance hall Hapa unajua mimi um, kitu moja watu wajui mimi nilikuwa dancehall artist even before hizi makorokoro ya gengeton mimi ndio gengeton kuni ni para tu ndani ya dance so tuka welcome gengeton lakini ukisikiza uh, mavazi zangu hizo muziki zote ndio wake fanya za dance za gengeton mavazi zangu zilikuwa tu za the dancehall kama 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 gani ile mnajua kama ile nyandu sinisema ni bebe mimi wako baby ni friday tena sema peide kibad man kemba boko leide madam smooth tunazita ode say tingaling galing school bella ring they got them they must fight for me team i'm a teacher me a kid them teaching they make it sound so they dance on too bad yeah so ngoma zote niko hata ile ngine nilifanya na ile ndo kororia they say i'm pretty young with a big body come follow me down to the party Make you more kidding say that it that it I'm gonna make you bend down that it that it So don't you need dance or so according to you you John Ray Marty but on a pulky dance Mimi ukinata ta twin the room banda ya katu dance on dance hero itakuwa umeona the room banda lakini utakupitishia tu mastime zangu huko ndani utazikuta tu huko ndani dance talking about expanding expanding our music industry you know mm-hmm. me, there's a there's a show you watched you mm-hmm. come mm-hmm. and show really mm-hmm. artistic tuesday yeah plan yake ni gani so plan ya artistic tuesday ni kupatia um, kwanza big uh, shout out kwanza kwa mzazi William tu mm-hmm. iko idea yake hii Okay. idea ile ya mwanzo ni yake. Sasa hata nilikuwa nafanyaga ile mambo wa wasanii tu hata mimi ni that's why I launched my first music video kwa platform yake. Mm-hmm. Ya mseto tu ana kubwa kufanya tu kama sasa inaitwa wakilisha Stephen. Mm-hmm. Na launch video yako hapo una perform for the first time and for to the world. Okay. Mm-hmm. So hakuna kitu kama ina happen sasa hii kwa sababu since hiyo kitu imeja so wala You want to tell me akuna wasanii wanatamani ku kutoa ngoma sahihi wa pia for the first time si wako wengi sana where are they launching the music okay sasa hizi mambo imebadilika sasa hizi si lazima wende tv si lazima wende radio ndio watu wakujue si ni kweli we need to show these people how it's done so we need to mentor these people we need to show them the business side si tu wewe utoe tu ngoma umepiga views hapo youtube na huna hata mia umeelewa so we need to show these people how and mentor them because sisi watu wengine kama sisi tuliingia nyasi kwanza kabla kupata le barabara ya muziki niko kwa tumevunja mamiti huko forest tukitafuta barabara na hakuna huko tumekoniwa kwa hii industry presenta amekula pesa wametuzungusha wengine paka wametutumia kimwili umeelewa baada zetu wanajua wengine hapo wamepigwa kitu sana na lemesha kwa sababu ya hii mambo tu ya muziki na daktar fame lakini yule jamaa akwambia ile iko anamwambia kuja kwanza ni Kwa hiyo so there's so many things we need to to, to remove in our society. Ndio tuweza kukaa pamoja. Tusi tusidanganyane bwana. Eh? Tukae vizuri. Ni kuonyesha bro, hii muziki inafanywa hivi. Kuna shortcut ni hivi na hivi na hivi na hivi utajikuta ume. Umefika pale. So later tuende hivi show busy kwa hivi na hivi na hivi na hivi. So artistic Tuesday iko purpose for the young artists. Young artists. Mm-hmm. The ones that are there and the legends mm-hmm. make it because of the legends also want to come and see the new energy mm-hmm. the new energy want to learn one to one or two things from the legend the artists are there they also need to know to come up for everyone to come to jamaa kwa pale juu by the legends mm-hmm. so everybody will learn something from each other at the same time the online media the the mainstream media watakuwa wanapata content utajua new people investors also will identify new artists because they want to change the mentality of people In Kenya nobody invests in music. Wao wanaweza kutoa msanii wako sahihi. Kwa sahihi unajua wangapi wewe? Wengi. Si unajua wengi. Mbona unajai kutoa elfu yako 50 ukasema mimi nashujua ujamaa wangu? People need to change their mentality. That is business. Sign a contract with him. Invest in that guy. You get? Why are people in other countries investing in artists? Yeah? Wao wanajua biscuit. Na mtambua. 
Sini msalimu kubwa zaidi. Mhm. Wana nani wizi kidalizaliwa tajiri? Mhm. Sali pesa ilitoka ya muziki ya kwanza. So, so, See what in our studio. So much money in that. For Bank W. Mm. Bank W invested in him. Sidio, paka kuja kujibaya out of the contract. Umeelewa? So somebody invested in him. Sisi yeye ni mkali sana. Somebody invested in him. Si ni ukweli. So who is going to invest in these other guys? Waje kuona msalimu mkubwa Kenya. Ukubwa ni pesa mwana. Paka uwekewe pesa ndio ujenge jumba mrefu ionekane kutoka mbali. Ama namna gani? So people need to invest in other people. And this is business. So we need to change the mentality. Why to watch to kwenda tu at msanii wa kuuliwa pombe ya dance. Na dance ya mtu unalinitu mzima wewe unampatia pombe. Eh? Invest in this talent. So we need to get business people to invest in this talent. But they need to first see the business part of it. Ndio kuje ndio mtu akuje atoe pesa yake invest. Mhm. Lazima kwa naona huyu wako na potential. Sasa ina jana alikuwa anataka kama mfungo sasa amenua baisikeli kesho amenua pikipiki kwa hiyo nikiinvest tutanua helicopter na tutanua wa private so artistic tuzi ile kwa happen wapi and where Wale leo huyu ni mama wangu kaja kidogo tu mbona kata yetu ndio na show mm-hmm. so um artistic tunes artistic tunes yes itakuwa inafanyika hapo black stars for now mm-hmm. every tuesday kwa sababu you see black stars is black stars iko hapo kilimani hapo opposite ola hapo mm-hmm. karibu na ya center hapo mbele hapo mkabala wa wood avenue okay hapo mm-hmm. you building your kwanza second floor okay. so itakuwa inafanyika hapo kwa sababu ya nini um mjana anajiuliza mbona wewe uko na club na unaenda club nyingine mm-hmm. that's the question ajio nataka kuni attack na kwa jana kujibu kwa kweli you see this is a vvip club it's a small club uh, it doesn't have a lot of seats so we want to keep it classy okay. and teach them the show is because balance rights to control and after kitu kingine we want to change the mentality that an artist Usipeleke msanii huko kwa manyasi huko na mwanzi huko pale chafu chafu kwa vumbi huko mwanzie huko juu ndio aende atafia haya heights umeelewa so it has to be tuache hiyo jinga kudharau wasanii bwana dharau waje msanii kwa eh ati msanii huyu mbona mbona anatembea tembea muheshi msanii kwa sababu hii ni future bwana eh inaanza hapa hivyo mwache kuona mwache kuona maindi kimea ngipano sina tupango kwa kitu kadogo hivi inakuja inakuwa mti mkubwa kwa nini hujawahi kudharau mbegu na unadharau msanii mwenye mtango mmoja mmoja heshima bwana mkimleta mnamuita kama boss kwa sababu atakuja kwa boss if you want to get something anza kuwa na hiyo mentality kwanza mhm umeelewa sasa ndio itakuja ikwe lakini wewe unakuwa mnyonge mnyonge hivi unataka kupita kwa macho macho unaishi kwa hizo macho mtu tembea kama boga ka kama star wa sasa hivi ndio mambo ikufunguke hata shida ikuogope kidogo wow. umeelewa okay. so we have to ndio ni command ileko pale pale classic kabisa ndio the change mentality wa sasa hivi msanii anaenda kwa ametoka mahali huko lakini akifika pale anasema wow so if i can if i can launch my product here that means the future is bright so for an artist to perform there what does it take akula manager anaitwa mzee jembe kama pale kwa kwa bayo yangu ile book ya richard don at gmail.com unaweza kutoa pale nini nini kwa instagram pale ukaongea na wewe msee hapo anaitwa mzee jembe plus anajua na wasanii wengi so hata tutakuwa tuna na pick from there then you know you get how tunapanga program yetu mapema ukifika pale unapiga ile shughuli nimekuleta basi mambo yanakaa the best in the world right the best thing when inafanyika every tuesday every tuesday yes kutoka 6 pm kwa sababu leo tuesday is a weekday this pm mimi mimi pia nimeandika kazi mara nyingine nimefanya kazi subuhi kutoka saa 12 mpaka saa 4 Sasa wote ni wapi na kwenye najua ni wapi na kwa sababu time check check let's talk a little bit about, uh, about of rather mm-hmm. show na piga na inspiration behind it i have a lot of content kia ni content kubwa sana you cannot unajua mimi naweza ni record kuanzia saa hii mpaka kesho clear sina ongea content mingi sana have a lot of things to tell with the world kwa sababu i am one in a million me have changed history I've changed this man nimekaa hapa sasa kuna mtu akikwambia mimi ni nani wewe utashangaa wewe uweze elewa kwa sababu unaona tukaja mambo fulani mimi nimechange mambo mengi kwa life yangu nimechange life ya watu wengi kuna wale watadharau lakini kuna wale wanajua what i mean to them so i have a lot of things to tell them because this thing 
this thing in the Konaya, not only Chulia Mchizo Mchizo, but I will change this country forever. You get? So I need to tell a lot of uh, youths the information that I have so that they can change their life also. You get? So I cannot be doing this via music. I have to entertain them and educate them. So off rather in the platform yangu ambayo naweza nikaongea to the masses. Every single day when music videos wezi kutoka kila siku it's a very expensive activity. Yeah. So hii ni production kidogo tu watu wawili watatu pale na watu wa graphics na nina nini na kila kila siku mambo na prepare so I can save at least one hour akufanya hii kitu ina air for 20 minutes ama kwa shot na kwa between 23 minutes to 16 minutes in between na kutoka sawa so tunaweza tukapeperishia kitu at least for this for this in a week yeah man so to collect our fans right last question before tuingie so the time is a kizushi uh how's been your life since the divorce it was hard pale pale it was kubwa bwana na tuko kana mtu miaka mingi because <laughs> Imagine yenye tuko inategemea unakimbia speed gani. Unajua unaweza kushikia mkono wako hapa ni kukimbiza hii barabara hapa. Ukifika pale unafikia utakufa sasa. Unajua sema mimi wewe unataka kunioa. Mimi usinipeleke hiyo speed. Umeelewa? Wacha ni kuacha. Wacha tuachane hapa. Na this our problem ni um kikwa na bitterness. Mnakosania unakuwa na machungu mingi juu wewe utaki forgive. Unaona nikao kiforgive utakufa utakufa. Just forgive bwana. Mbelela, mimi ni forgive. Mimi hakuna kitu siwezi forgive. Mimi can forgive even somebody when I'm home tunajua. You get? Because niki ku forgive inanitoka and then you are the one who bears the burden. So mimi I forgive a lot. So kuna watu wengine they don't forgive. Mbelela kwa sababu mimi ndio nilikuwa na shida mimi kwa imam. Sasa mimi naka chemka 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 chemka. Akasema ni takufa sasa. Mimi naenda na huyu mtu anyua sasa. Kila siku ni makesi mara amezalisha na mara amesijui demo gani, mara amekuja na mulevi. Mara si lakini ana ana sawa ile good side kuna pia good side ya boha. Mimi simbaya tu. 